going on all you fish folk out there? It's Kyle Crothers here at Ocean State Aquatics TV. Today we got a special treat today. We're going to talk about tank cycling and the nitrogen cycle. All the good bacteria that's responsible for keeping your fish alive. So we're going to begin with the nitrogen cycle. This is a critical element to the aqua overall aquarium health and keeping all of your fish alive. Now whenever you add fish or fish excretes waste or you add, put in food to the tank to feed them, it's all going to decay and, and create ammonia. Now nit the nitrosomos aerobic bacteria comes in and breaks down that ammonia and creates nitrite. S just like ammonia, nitrite is also toxic at high levels in the aquarium. So then there's an, an additional bacteria in your aquarium and that is nitrobacter and they're going to come in and take that nitrite and form nitrite. Now nitrite is a byproduct but it is relatively harmless in low levels and we can control that through water changes. So as long as you keep up on your water changes your nitrite levels are going to be low and as long as the tank has been established for quite some time the other ammonia and nitrate levels should also be low. So now that we understand the natural process, how highly toxic ammonia and nitrite are then converted through the use of beneficial bacterium in your aquarium to a, uh, the less harmful nitrate byproduct, um, we can then talk about how to begin the, the, the cycling process in your aquarium. Now when you buy an aquarium and you, and you bring it home, you're going to fill, fill it with water, all the decorations, you're going to have that urge to just put all the fish you want right in there. Now, you're gonna have to resist this urge, unfortunately. Um, the, that bacteria in the tank is gonna take time to develop. Uh, it takes about a month or so, uh, depending on the tank size. And, um, but there are ways of accelerating that process in your tank uh, to get the tank cycled. Uh, we can, the, the number one uh, way we do that here at Ocean State Aquatics is through the use of uh, different types of nitrifying bacteria in, in bottle form that we can add to the tank to help accelerate the process of, of cycling that aquarium. So how do we know when the tank is finally done being cycled and we got that good buildup of beneficial bacteria in the tank so we can start putting in the fish that we want? We do this through the means of test kits. Now there's a wide variety available. Uh, you can bring in your water right here to the shop. We test the ammonia, we test the nitrite, we in the nitrate. Uh, or you can buy a test kit yourself and do it right at home. It's a great way to monitor those spikes throughout the cycle and then you can then use those to determine if the tank is fully cycled and you can slowly start slowly adding fish I can't emphasize slowly enough and you can as well as you add fish you can test again and make sure that when all your fish are in there they're nice and safe and the, and the tank definitely ha can handle the bio load. Now that's going to do it here for OSHA State Aquatics TV. I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, keep on reefing out there.